Ready Redemption 2 Gameplay Part 1 Okay Well, he's surely big, but his intelligence is a matter of some conjecture. Some say he is as dumb as he looks, but I think, well, he's not quite that dumb. So these are the boys going to Caliga Hall? Yes, we could take care of that for you, but one hates to be coarse. There is the I'll question see. of money. <laughs> oh, we've got money, Mr. Matthews. Paper, bonds, metals. <laughs> she ain't gonna pay you with a certified check, you Yankee numbskull. Ain't childbirth just the most beautiful miracle on earth? Seems a lady can birth monkeys, after all. Can I drive? Nope. Yeah, one day I'll be able to drive. All right, let's get this over with. You was quiet in there. Took everything I had. That son of horse. I'll shove that <laughs> silver spoon <laughs> down his throat and pull it clean out of his ass. The smug fucker. Okay. 
So what's Eight she ten. got us doing at the Gray's place? She wants us to torture tobacco fields. Said they ain't had rain in weeks round here. So Where are we moving? Wet That's right. What? One foot yeah. in front of the other. Using that back there. Moonshine? Horns faster than kerosene, that stuff. Said it'd be fitting, she did. All I'm thinking is how about I try fitting my boot up your hook. No, just snotty old bitch. <laughs> Jose really picked the right fella for tea at the manor, didn't he? Ah, oh, he was giving his usual flannel. One of these families got ghosts that yeah, somewhere he reckons. Make, I mean, yeah. I'm more for sticking it to rich folks. I hate rich folks. But they really barely so bloody money at the end of all this. Jose knows what he's doing. Does he though? The master finagler of nothing. Oh, easy, easy. So far, we've destroyed the Braithwaite still. Tried to sell the shine back to them. Now we're on this fool's errand, which I'm very much looking forward to, by the way. They were saying old man Gray's double security after that business at the saloon. They just robbed their horses, too. That was you? Jesus. Yeah. So, we're just gonna drive on in there, is that it? Don't worry. I got a plan. Wagons go in and out of there all the time with supplies, equipment, payroll. Especially now they're taking on all that extra muscle. We're making a delivery. That's all. Just leave it to me. I can talk a dog off a of meat wagon. <laughs> all right, then. Yeah. Kalangalaman side poorano bolu. Bali tharamir. Udra kaundra amasi. Parra puli man puli bolu. Oor kulana man bolu. Are you not worried about them greys, English? Excuse me? You not worried about them greys? In what sense? Well, well they know you. Yeah, maybe you're right. You know what? Here, I'll go hide and back. If you can act naturally and stop us from getting into a fight before we're ready. I will try. Yes. Try and do an impression of a human being. I'm not going to go that far. <laughs> We're here. Stay out of sight. I'll do the talking. Hey, hold it right there. Hey, you want boy? Yeah, boy. 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 Talking about? Well, I'm delivering the supplies. You're not the usual driver. Uh, you want a bottle, friend? Here. Uh, uh, have a wee drop. <laughs> I'm new. I, I mean, you know, harm. Uh, <laughs> I, I've come from Donegal in Ireland. You don't say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they said you'd understand uh, some kind of incident at the saloon in town. I was told to bring this up here. Ask no questions, I'll tell you no lies, uh, sort of business, eh? Uh, before the officials got there. Oh, okay. 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 Drive this way. I'll show you how to get there. Oh, thank you, friend. Uh, have a drink, Sean. <coughs> Hamish. Good to meet you, Hamish. <laughs> Uh, fine bit of country you've got here. Uh, not as fine as Connemara, but fine nonetheless. My people come from Scotland. Oh, is that right? Then you and I are nearly brothers. <laughs> Just over here. Yeah, it's straight down the path here. It's getting so I can barely keep track of all these deliveries coming in. Yeah, and they said they was looking for more drivers in town. I jumped at the chance. I ain't never been a feller to kick a bit of honest work out of bed. <laughs> so, you folks been having a hard time of it, have you? 
Yeah, Mr. Gray's got a heap of problems right now with another family around here. A bunch of covetous lowdowns trying to sabotage his livelihood. Disgusting. Ah, oh, dear, oh dear. I'm sorry to hear that, Hamish. Sounds like you definitely deserve that drink. <laughs> you don't know the half. Just in there. Ah, right you are. <laughs> you can unload it here. In here? Oh, <laughs> the horse is like a, a swift one, <clears throat> do they? <laughs> Excuse me? Uh, nothing. It's grand. <clears throat> <clears throat> Nothing wrong there. Uh, quite a place you yeah. boys have got here. <laughs> Reminds me of one of them big houses there. Uh, out in Donegal. Huh. Real fancy place as they was, Hamish. Fancy, because if some folks got all the money, they can build quite that fat. <coughs> okay, <coughs> hold up in here till it gets dark. <laughs> How you getting on? Good. Nearly got these things ready. Okay. <coughs> There's plenty of guards out there. Here's how I feel we should deal with things. You head over to the dry barn. Sure. And you? I'm gonna deal with the fields themselves. We coat everything in moonshine. Then we light things up with these little fellers here. Thankfully, it ain't rained. And that old barn over there should go up like a torch. <laughs> How many of these boys you think you need? They should do it. Let's head out the back. Look, once they get wind of us, there'll be no turning back, so move the quick. Of course, a rebel stock boy. With his bar burning down matter houses. We'll burn quietly. There's someone coming on the left. Ha. Oh, hey. Well, I, I thought the wagon already arrived. This one didn't. Strange. So, what you got there? Tools, payroll. Okay. Drop it by the supply shed at the back of the fields. Sure. See you later. You hear that? Payroll. Yeah. Let's get this job done first, okay? I'll take care of this fella. Hmm. I'm still digging line. Come on. You douse the fields, I'll meet you at the barn. Try to stay out of trouble. Well, you follow me for you, Egypt. I thought you was down to the fields. I That's good.
be enough for here. Give this a quick dose as well. Right. Think she'll go, Arthur. Line her up. Woo Would you look at that? <laughs> now let's go light yourselves a fat cigar. These fellas, you keep on it. You'll pay for this. What? Company, look out! Come on! those horses. Well, let's see if the payroll is actually in there. Hurry up. 
Oh boy! We did good, Morgan! We did good! Great, but let's go! Looky here, you get them horses free, Martha! Come on! Yeah! Okay, let's get the hell out of here, fast! You right, follow me! Yo no, 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 Turn into a right party. You call that a party? That freight weight had got a money's worth, Ollie. Let's just get out of here first. Ah, that's a bit much. Lock on the bench. What the hell? I think we lost them. That we did. Quite a night. Sure. Interesting little fight Dutch has put us into the middle of here. Uh, I hope him and Jose are riding that there's some money at the end of it. Well, what now? Head on back to camp. You coming? Later. I, I got some business. Right you are, English. Another job well done, I'd say. Yeah. Take it easy. Maka. 
Blessed are the peacemakers, for they shall be called... Hey, Molly, where's Dutch? Well, however it goes. I'm not sure all that line of thought serves you and me very well. Uh, that's because, Cowpoke, you are a man of profoundly limited intelligence. No doubt. Well, you and the old man and Dutch have been running around, digging us ever deeper into shit. Old Mr. Pearson might have gone and lightened the load a little. Pearson! Ain't you curious? I guess. Gentlemen. Dutch, you tell him, fat man. It's peace, Dutch. The Adriscals. I mean, I think there's a way. What on earth are you talking about? Get the words out properly, fat man. I met a couple of the Adriscal boys on the road in the town. Things were about to get ugly. But you know how I am in a fight, huh? Like a corner tight. <laughs> anyway, somehow it didn't, but we got to talking, and they suggested a parlay to end mm -hmm. things. Like gentlemen. Gentlemen. Yeah. Comb O'Driscoll. <clears throat> Have you lost your mind? You're always telling us, Dutch. Do what has to be done, but don't fight wars ain't worth fighting. They want a parlay? It's a trap. Well, of course, it's probably a trap, but what do we got to lose finding out? Get shot. We ain't getting shot because you'll be protecting us. It's a trap. You shoot a lot of them. If it ain't a trap, that's slim chance. I don't see the point in any of this. It's a chance. Gotta take it. I killed Combs' brother a long time ago. Then he killed a woman I loved dear. Mm. As you say, it's a long time ago, Dutch. Let's go. You and me, with Arthur protecting us, no one else. What about me? This ain't the time for tigers, my friend. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, I'm gonna go to the house. I'm gonna go to You know, I've been fighting... Ugh! I've been fighting Cone for so long now, I can barely remember a time when it was different. And you're still fighting him now. Make no mistake of that. Here he goes, Doubting Thomas. Is there any plan you ain't sour on? Well, uh, maybe you're right. Just nervous. Let's not waste any more lives needlessly. Careful. I ain't costing lives here. I'm saving them. What did you say? We had Pinkertons coming after us. Because of Blackwater and Leviticus Cornwall and his private army. Then who knows when this local hillbilly thing will come to a head. Hmm? Can we really afford to be fighting on all these fronts and O'Driscoll? There is wisdom in that. Uh, I hope so, gentlemen, but... Like I said, I'm nervous. Look, you ain't even going to be the one in danger. We'll get on over there, find a nice perch for you to settle into. You got that rifle, don't you? Yeah, yeah. Then me and Dutch walk right into the lion's den. With you to cover us. Hmm? Okay, just keep calm. Unless I give you a reason not to. Oh, we'll be fine. We got you. I will do my best. Oh, my dear and trusted friend, with you watching over me, I would walk into hell itself. As would I. Driscoll's from the look of them. 
I don't like having eyes on us. We're close. You'll be the eyes soon enough. Maybe he's right, Dutch. Maybe I have pushed too hard. Got us into situations that could have been safer. I just... I see all those mouths we gotta feed, and I... I dream too big. Caring too much. That's my problem. Caring too much? There's no such thing. This is horse shit from both of you. It might be. Micah might be full of shit. Como O'Driscoll might be full of shit. The promise of this great nation. Men created equal. Liberty and justice for all. That might be nonsense too. But it's worth trying for. It is worth believing in. Can't you see that, friend? I don't know. Try. All I ask is you try. All right, cowpoke. You're gonna peel off up ahead. We'll be meeting down on the plane. Find a spot just above us where you can keep an eye on things. All right, all right. However this shakes out, let's aim to meet back at the fork in the road afterwards. We'll be there, partner. Yeah. Kano, Varana, Varana, Hello, Dutch. It's been a while. <clears throat> sure. So, uh, how's your gang doing? They still believing in you? Better world. Pure world. Hm? How's that coming along? Just fine. Hmm. How's that score you stole off us? Which one? <laughs> oh, I like that. It's like I said, this is a charismatic leader. A lot of heat mm. on us this time. Both of us. Whole heap of trouble. They offered me a price, Dutch, to bring you in. Why didn't you take it? Well. Still might. I am sorry about your brother. Yeah, well, I never liked him much. I liked Annabelle. Y'all always love the ladies, Dutch Vanderlyn. I like that about you. What are we doing here? Go home. Is this thing over? Hello, sugar. You ain't dead, is you? Not get away. Hey. I don't know. Call 
haven't got a sense. Handing him over to the law, it's, I don't know. Strange times. They killed Seamus. Fuck the whole lot of them. With this fella Colum's right, we can draw them all back. He's escaping, shoot him! Relax! Relax. I got it. Did I kill you? Oh, not yet. <laughs> no, of course not. Not yet. But I will. Oh, Jesus, die, la. That's it. Out of fire. Put his weapons over there! Put a stone tangle on our anger. The Dutch, you want to end up on Ranga, Mark? What is that? Sold less of Tarang. Baranda Cotra, what a pavi. What is that? Ay, 
Yeah. Shoot your hole. I don't want to go to Mexico. I want to go home. Home. Hold on, I'll be back in a minute. What the hell? What? I'll keep by the scepter. What's he still doing down there? It's one thing torturing a man, it's another thing putting him through stories of the homeland. He better hurry it up. I don't want to be here when the law comes from that side of beef. I'm going to go to Who is it? My dear boy, what? They got me. But I got away. Yeah. Yeah, you did. Hey, Grimshaw! I need help! Reverend Swanson's gonna set the law on our fellow, of course he was! I'm sorry, Arthur. It's a bit late for apologies. Swanson! Mr. Morgan! Mr. Morgan, you're safe now! Oh, let's get him to bed! You are safe now, Arthur. Safe now. Uh, that's pretty. It does. That's real pretty. Miss Grimshaw, will you sit with him a while? Of course. You'll be okay, Mr. Morgan. You're home. Mm hmm. Tell 
சொல்ல கேட்கலனா அப்படிதான் பிளானாக இருக்கும் பிளானாக இருக்கும்னு சொல்ல கேட்டாதில்ல சொயா புத்தியே இல்லை அந்த டச்சுக்கு ஒரு ஓலை நம்மளை போட்டு தள்ளுறதுக்கான பிளானாக இருக்கும் ஃபியூ வீக்ஸ் லேட்டர் சில வாரங்கள் இருக்கிறப்ப I thought I'd be burying you, Mr. Morgan. Mm-hmm. Well, not quite yet, River. Good. How you feeling? Oh, about the same as you. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> well, take care of yourself. You too. அடுத்த ஜாபுக்கு போவோம் காப்பாத்தி கூட்டு வந்துட்டேன் ஒரு கேரக்டர் ஃப்ரீ நல்லா இருக்கா சரி வேற ஏதாவது தரணுமே ஆ இது தரேன்
Been waiting for you, Arthur. Well, I'm sorry to have kept you. Come on, let's get going. What's the plan? We're meeting a couple of the Greys over at the saloon. They spoke to Bill about a job, needing security. After the farce of stealing the horses for them, why are we doing this? Because we need to stay in with them, and they're paying. So what kind of security they want? We're about to find out. Now come on. This seem legit to you, Bill? Sure. Dutch said we was to keep on dealing with them until we find this gold. Can we trust them? Can we trust anyone? Yeah. Let's just see what they say. They said there was some big misunderstanding about them horses. And what about board and their fields? They don't know we had anything to do with that. Oh, that's so. Yeah. They think it was the Braithwaite's. Listen, I know these great boys a bit now. This is on the level. We're stuck in the middle of some ancient feud, but instead of playing both sides, we're being used by both of them. They were saying that Catherine Braithwaite... Hey, hold up. This don't feel right. Now it don't feel right? I could have told you... What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's Sons of bitches. What the... You think I'm going to go I can't believe you shot me, you bastard! You okay? I'm fine! Ah, oh, Sean! You idiot! Look at him! What? Okay, See there! Turn around! How could you not think what? this was a trap? You sure you want to take it? I'm not being alive. You see your way out of here? All right now, that guy's been dead good. Better low on bullets here. No more joy. No, no, Is no, this no, the no, best no. you fools got? Never shoot a chance at me. Oh, oh you're oh, your. I'll get you. Oh, oh, you get the prize. You get the prize. None of these bastards gonna oh, walk out of here. Oh, 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 Nothing for me. There's plenty more where I came from. Now you're dead. So yeah, I'm thinking the Greys might be onto us after all. Now it's sinking in. This is your fault. So fight. much for loot. What damn loot? We ain't getting out of this with nothing. And that's assuming we even get out of it. Of course we're getting out of it. This is you and me, Morgan. We always get the job done. You call this getting the job done? See that? Those cowards are running away. Looks like most of them. Not all of them. Sure, Gray. What about Bill? Where the hell's he? We'll find him later. Come on. Gray! You need to get a hold on this town. It's going to hell. Who do you think you are? Bunch of two big thugs from God knows where? You so dumb to think we don't know what you've been doing? Come out, Sheriff! It's over! 
We put down far worse than you a hundred times over. This is the Grays town. Always has been, always will be. Only Grays I see left around here is you. You want us to come out? We'll come out! Get! Oh, Bill! Guns on the ground, now! Both of you, don't do it! You know we can't do that. You put the gun down, Sheriff! I'll blow his brains out! You want to join your little friend there, do you? Either way, you're a dick. Ajiyoh, cuti baru potong na. Pocha, pocha. Bilu setra na, cah. Ada na pakai bela pa. So. Dah ada misa apa, tuan? Don't do it. You know we can't do that. You put the gun down, chef. I'll blow his brains out! You want to join your little friend there, do you? Either way, you're a dead man. Morgan? He was a good kid. Well, how the hell was I to know? Let me see. They set us up once before. They didn't like us. We destroyed their farm. Should I go on? Go easy on him, Morgan. He was out trying to find a lead. Same as you. Same as Hosea. All you do is complain when things don't work out. Except when it's your goddamn fault. You don't know what you're talking about. You don't give a damn about nobody but yourself. Oh, you act so high and mighty, but you're no better than the rest of us. I've ridden with you boys close on what, six months now? And all you ever done was complain. You can fight, but you can't think. You can't do either. <laughs> okay, cowpoke. Bill, take the boy's body. Hurry him proper someplace quiet. Micah, best you and I don't speak for a moment. <laughs> I'm just so frightened by you. Get out of my sight, pair of fools. Time for turn on. He was like an annoying little brother to me. What fun we had riding together. What a goddamn mess we are making of things. Hey, mission complete.
go. ஒரு நாலு மரட்டரோட இந்த கேமை பார்த்து முடிக்கிறேன் பார்த்த பாட்டில் சந்திக்கிறேன் பா